Okay. This is where we should encounter a phone call, right? Right? There we go! We mm, all right. Awake as hell. Hey, uh, this is Undyne. Shut up, Papyrus. This is your idea. Human, uh, you have to deliver something for me. Uh, please? I'm at Snowden in front of Papyrus's. See ya, punk. Click. Alright. But yeah, super sucks that there's only like three of us. You know, it's like five, three. I don't know numbers anymore. But, so I'm, I'm really trying to raise some money. I really want to do a good thing. Uh, actually, I had, one of the ladies who donated actually had her child or her grandchild um, at the same hospital or a hospital like it. And it's like, that's what I'm doing this for. I'm doing this for kids because last year I broke my arm. And I just, I like fractured a little bit, and luckily it's bloody fine now. Um, but, like, there's a lot worse than that. I thought that was the worst, thing. like, that is the most painful thing I've ever experienced. And then there's a lot of kids who have a lot worse of a life that I can't even imagine, and I don't really want to, and everybody's uncomfortable with it, so let's just make it better. You know? I didn't go the right way. But yeah, I just I just want to make people's lives better in general. I think there's so much... Uh, this sounds like the super, like, Miss America answer, but there's so much, like, freaking hate in the world with all the spammers and all the, like, trolls on the internet and all the jerks. Like, oh my god, there's so many jerks in the world. Like, if I had a list, it would, you know, cover this whole room of the list of people that have bullied me or, like, just suck people that suck. Um, so it's like, you know, why not put out something? The only thing that I'm actually, like, good at, or, I mean, I'm, I'm not great at it, but it's, it's a thing. It's a thing that I can do that doesn't, I was gonna say doesn't take, like, a lot out of me, but I'm staying away for 40, 24 goddamn hours, which is a lot. I don't normally do this, ever. I'm the kind of person that gets nine hours of sleep every night. And can't sleep in past 7. And can't really stay up past 11.30 without getting sick. So I'm very surprised that I am functioning and that I have energy and that I am awake right now. Okay, you're in the wrong house. Oh, gross, you to go to Red Spiders. I just like that. Hey, girl. Um, so I have a favor to ask you. Uh, I, I need you to deliver this letter. To Dr. Elvis. Uh-huh. Why don't I do it myself? Oh, look at this. And, well. It's kind of personal, but we're friends. So, I'll tell you. Hotland sucks. I don't want to have to go over there. Feel you. I live in Hotland. And then, it decides to be 40 degrees at night. So, I'm... I'm in this horrifying limbo where it's hot land in the day and snowed in in the night. Hate it. Okay. <laughs> so here you go. You got the Undyne's letter. Oh, and if you read it, I'll kill you. Thanks so much. You're the best. I know I am. Well, snowed in is a pretty little town, isn't it? I actually have not checked the shop in an awfully long time. Uh, the kid's gone. That's who it is. I was like, somebody's missing. Kiddo. Bye. Oh, my Cinnabon. Exit. I now come again sometime. I will indubitably, ma'am. I have never stayed in here. Snowden's Premier Hotel, one night is 80. Yeah, I don't, I don't have that. I should've. <clears throat> but you know what? Nah, screw it. These bunnies are creepy and adorable. Oh, God. Good old Preachy. 
Like, oh my god, I just want the world to be a better place. But I actually, like, do. You know, hot land. We do not live anywhere near waterfall. I'm so uh, itchy. Uh, my spine. Where's my Pokemon blanket? Oop. You can have never have too many hot dogs. That is good advice. Sadly, that's not true. You can have eight. That's the maximum number. Oh, it's so warm. It's actually not that warm, but it's look at his gaping maw. Oh, gaping maw. <coughs> Alrighty. Let's deliver a letter. Let's deliver a letter to Undyne. Er, <coughs> from Undyne. Slide the letter under. Slide. You slide the letter under the door and give it a knock. <coughs> uh, oh no. Isn't that another letter? <coughs> I don't want to open it. Can't I just slide it back out? No. I can't keep doing this. I'll read this one. <clears throat> um, it's shut kind of strongly, isn't it? Wait a second. Hey, if this is a joke, it's... Oh my god. Did you write this letter? It wasn't signed, so I had no idea who it could have been. Oh my god, oh no. That's adorable. <clears throat> And I had no idea that you, um, wrote that way. It's surprising, too, after all the gross stuff I did. <clears throat> I don't really deserve to be forgiven. Much less, um, this. And so passionately, too. <clears throat> you know what? Okay, I'll, I'll do it. It's the least I can do to make it up to you. Yeah, yeah let's go on a date. Dating start. Which mark? Uh, sorry, I'm still getting dressed. It's adorable. Oh, how do I look? <clears throat> My friend helped me pick out this dress. <clears throat> She's got a great sense of. Um. Anyway, let's just let's do this thing. <clears throat> Dating start. Hey, hey, wait. Actually, we still can't start the date yet. <clears throat> Dating. Stop. Um, I've got to give you items to raise your affection statistic first. That'll increase the chance of a successful outcome to the state. Right? Anyway, don't worry. That sounds like honey pop. I'm prepared. I've been stockpiling gifts in anticipation for this for a day like this. First, I got some metal armor polish. Uh, maybe you can't use that. But, I also brought some waterproof cream for your scales. Your, um, scales. Um, well, how about, uh, this magical spear repair kit that I... Um, hey, let's forget about the items. Let's just skip to the start of the date. Dating, start. <coughs> Yeah, let's, uh, date. <clears throat> My mouse is on the screen. <clears throat> you wanna do something there, friend? <clears throat> do you like anime? Yeah! Hey, me too. Hey, let's go somewhere. Where's a good place to go on a date? I've got it. Let's go to the garbage dump. Here we are. This is where Undyne and I come all the time. We find all sorts of great stuff here. <laughs> She's really... Uh... <clears throat> oh no. That's her over there. I can't let her see me on a date with you. Why? Because, uh, well... Oh no, here she comes. Oh, oh, here she comes. Hey, there you are. I, uh, realized I, if you delivered that thing, it might be a bad idea. So I'm gonna do it. Give it to me. Oh, you don't have it? Ah. Uh, have you at least seen her? Uh. Uh. 
Uh, have I, guys? Uh... <clears throat> Say nope? Okay. No? But she wasn't at home. Where the heck could she be? Oh my god. Well, I guess it's obvious, huh? I, uh... I really like her. I mean, more than I like other people. I'm sorry. I just figured, you know, it'd be fun to go on like a cute kind of pretend date with you. Just make you feel better? Well, it sounds even worse when I put it like that. Oh, that's adorable. I love it. You're really, really good artist. I am not, sadly. It's over here. Well, it sounds even worse when I put it like that. I'm sorry, I messed up again. Undyne's the person I um, really want to go on a date with. But I mean, she's way out of my league. Not that you aren't, um, cool. But Undyne, she's so confident and strong and funny. And I'm just a nobody, a fraud. I'm the royal scientist, but all I've ever done is hurt people. I've told her so many lies, she thinks I'm... She thinks I'm a lot cooler than I actually am. If she gets closer to, close to me, she'll... She'll find out the truth about me. What should I do? Tell her the truth or keep lying? Tell her the truth, right? 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 Tell her the truth? No, I ship these two. Tell her the truth. Good. The truth? Oh. That or they could have a, a different, like a, a third gender. And, you know, I know some, some like, worlds have a third gender that's like not really either one. But, you know, whatever. I don't, I don't care. <clears throat> but if I tell her that she'll hate me. Isn't it better this way? To live a lie where both people are happy? Or a truth where neither of us are? They say be yourself, but I don't really like who myself is. I'd rather just... Shut up, Clash of Clans. I'd rather just be whatever makes people like me. <laughs> no, you're right. Every day I'm scared. Scared what will happen if people learn the truth on their own. They'll all get hurt because of me. But how can I tell Undyne the tr truth? I don't have the confidence. I'm going to mess it up. How can I practice? Let's roleplay it. Does this matter? This this game makes me question a lot of things. Like, does does it matter if I say let's role play it or obviously let's role play? <clears throat> I'm gonna say let's role play it. Three, two, cool. R role play. That actually sounds kind of fun. Okay, which one of us will be undying? Make and make Alphys Undyne. Okay, you'll be Undyne. Me? Undyne? Uh, okay. I'll say what I think she says, and you, um, you show me what I'm supposed to do. Ahem. Yeah. Hey, Alphys, you look cute today. Which I say often, but platonically, because I would never like you. Hi, Undyne. Can we talk? Right? Not, yo, you're one hot baby? 
First one, right? Really? Seriously? That's what I need to say? Why? Why? <clears throat> Seriously? Okay. What? Alpheus! What's gotten into you? A hot baby! How dare you call me that? First off, I'm a baby knight! Captain of the babies! <laughs> Captain of the babies, treat my position with respect, or I will strike you down! Uh, now pretend I'm suplexing a boulder for no reason. Suplexing a boulder for no reason. Um, anyway, what do you say, Alphys? Let's tell Undyne the truth. Alphys gives you a kiss. Let's tell Undyne the truth, right? Yes? Truth or kiss? What? I would never... Alphys, what are you doing? I say, pushing you away from me. You shouldn't kiss me. But you're so good at it because of what you learned from those dating video games. I can't help but kiss you back. Ah! I'm Undyne and I'm pillaging on the smooches. <laughs> what? Did you just say? I picture Undyne kind of like Wendy from Gravity Falls. Uh, Undyne, I was just... Hey, whoa, wait a second. Your outfit's really cute, what's the occasion? Wait a second. Are you two on a date? Uh, yes. I mean, uh, no. I mean, we were, but I mean, actually, we were only romantically role-playing as you. What? I mean, I mean, Undyne, I, I've been lying to you. What? About what? About, well, everything. I told you that seaweed was like science. Use it to make ice cream and those human sister books to keep reading. Those are just dorky comic books. And the movie's history, those those are just uh anime. They aren't real. And that time I told you I was busy working with the phone, I was just eating frozen yogurt in my pajamas. Uh Yeah, that that works actually really well. I want fan art of them as Dipper and Wendy. That'd be adorable. Alphys. I just wanted to impress you. I just wanted you to think I was smart and cool. That I wasn't some nerdy loser. Although Alphys could totally be voiced by Mabel. Alphys. Undyne, I, I really think you're neat, okay? Alphys. Oh. I think you're neat too, I guess. <clears throat> but you've got to realize, most of what you said doesn't matter to me. I don't care if you're watching kid cartoons or reading history books. To me, all of that stuff is just nerdy crap. What I like about you is that you're passionate, you're analytical. It doesn't matter what it is, you care about it. 100% and maximum power. So. You don't have to lie to me. I don't want to have to lie to you, anyone. I don't want you to have to lie to anyone anymore. Alphys, I want you to be. I want to help you become happy with who you are. And I know just the training you need to do that. <sighs> Undyne, you. You're gonna train me? Look at the little hearts in your eyes! 
What? Me? <laughs> nah, I'm gonna get Papyrus to do it. Get those bones shaking! It's time to draw 100 laps! Hooting about how great we are! <laughs> that face! Already, I'm about to start the timer. I'm fine. I'll do my best. Papyrus equals Zeus. I accept that. Cake? Yeah. Cake? Do I have any? How big of a piece do you want? Huh? How big of a piece do you want? Okay. Do you want vanilla ice cream with it? Yes. Or pepper? Vanilla. I'm gonna go potty first and then. Cool. Oh my god. She was kidding, right? Those cartoons, those comics, those are still real, right? Sans equals Mabel. Acceptable. Anime is real, right? Anime is real. Anime is real. That's what I'm. <laughs> I knew it! Gigantic swords, magical princesses, here I come. No. No. Uh, thanks for taking care of Alphys. Hi, Rambo! Oh, no. You terrible animal. Though. No, he's so cute. They should he's see cute. Look how cute he is. You wanna see? No, look. Oh, he's just gonna wiggle. Hi, so cute. Okay, bye, everyone. Bye, Fred! <laughs> oh, that's at a weird angle. I'm not even shot right now. Not at all. Gross. Okay. I didn't want to say. Oh my god, he's back! No, man. <laughs> Come on, the struggle is real. Come on, let's go. Who's Stan? Ah. Mm. Asgore? Nah, not cool enough. Who's close to Stan? I don't know. Ah. Yeah, Sans might be a, a Mabel Stan hybrid. I will, I will accept that. Hmm. Okay. Um, I didn't get to say what I wanted to, but. Things seem like they're going better, going to get better for her. Well, I was going, I gotta go catch up with them. Later.